Hello everyone, you're watching the Culver City Beat. I'm Juliette Lamar and this week Culver City Police arrest a parolee carrying a replica handgun. And places of worship can hold indoor services once again after a Supreme Court ruling. So stay tuned. But first, I want to tell you all about our sponsor, Hypothermia Cancer Institute, the best cancer treatment that you've never heard of. Go ahead and click below for more info. Our top story today, Westside frontline healthcare workers are seeing a light at the end of the pandemic tunnel as they begin to receive the COVID-19 vaccine. We have the full story right here and we'll be right back with today's local news after this. And now for what's happening in your neighborhood. A parolee riding a bike and carrying a replica handgun was arrested by Culver City Police in the area of Washington Place and Bentley Avenue. Police reported that the suspect was carrying a replica 9mm Beretta handgun and when questioned, the suspect gave a fake name. After determining that the suspect's true identity, police arrested the parolee for violating his parolee terms. Just in time for the holidays, Los Angeles County churches are now allowed to hold indoor services with a few restrictions. The LA County Health Order was slightly modified after a ruling by the Supreme Court that houses of worship are now permitted to conduct faith-based services indoors as long as they adhere to mandatory physical distancing protocols. And of course, all participants must wear a face covering over the nose and mouth at all times. Despite churches now being allowed to host indoor services, LA County health officials are still strongly encouraging places of worship to host services outdoors when possible. That's all the news that we have for you today. Thank you all so much for tuning in. I'm Juliette Lamar and you take care.